determined demonstrators in Benin City, the Edo state capital. The group is made up of some returnees from Libya who claim that in recent times, different individuals and groups have found them vulnerable enough to be used as pawns. We said they should turn us into agriculture. Yes. yes. They claim in the, in, the, in, uh, uh, in the fanatical congregation that they are going to train us into agriculture, but when the training was to proceed, they said the agriculture is not a mall. However, this set of returnees had also taken part in the training program in question. I achieved something, at least the back session, and I learned it very well. I learned how to cut cloth with hand. Because you not cut the hand separate, you just join the hand, everything. I learned how to do that, do that one. Solomon Okodua is the senior special assistant to the Edo state government on anti-human trafficking issues. When we heard it, we found out to, to know why, why they were actually protesting. So I pulled a couple across with some of them and I found out that yes, they were saying that they were trained. The training were just a kangaroo training and uh, they don't, that is not part of the training. That, that they, they thought that this woman has collected money from XYZ to, you know, to use them to justify the money. I said no. So you relax and let's see how we can, uh, you know, go into the matter. The organizer of the training exercise, Doreen Yusuf, has benevolence as a key idea behind her project. The kind of empowerment I told them I was going to give to them, I said, I'm going to train you. You're going to learn a trade. I want you to have an alternative to, to, to going to Libya with barefoot. I want you to have alternative to going abroad. You can learn a skill here. I have no collaboration with anyone. Nobody gave me a grant. No 10 million was given to me from anywhere. As many returnees rescued from human trafficking attempts still await empowerment, those interested in assisting them are encouraged to follow government's approved procedures. Jessica Olubusere, Channels Television News.